tweeted a picture of an envelope earlier to the um, head of the 1922 committee. What are you asking for? What do you think should happen now? I think we need a new leader and it's it's really sad and I came to Parliament at the same time as Theresa May and I've never put in a letter of no confidence in a leader of the Conservative Party in my 22 years here but um, frankly this has got to be uh, resolved. I can see no way out of the impasse that we're in at the moment on Brexit and I'm afraid I can't see any way out with Theresa May um, leading it. We need a new leader very quickly with a new fresh approach to try and break through this uh, impasse and that's why I wrote a letter to, to Graham Brady saying uh, I think we need to have a leadership um, election and if they change the rules we may be able to do that in a matter of the next few weeks. Do you think as one of your colleagues said to me earlier it's now about the messenger I mean you don't like the deal anyway but is the messenger part of the problem now that even if she came up with yeah. something that was suitable no one's really listening? I think it's been played wrong on so many levels and I think six months ago there were people saying gosh she's really resilient, she's really tough, she's trying to get this deal uh, through even though it was the wrong deal and I think there have always been components with it. I voted for the the deal in the last two votes that we had simply because I thought the alternatives were much worse, we might lose Brexit altogether. I think now coming back for the fourth time with a deal which is even worse than the first one and has got conditions in it around second referendums uh, and around customs union which absolutely do not deliver Brexit and which we've been standing out um, against just make it impossible for me to vote for. We're going backwards and we've got to go forwards and we have to do it with the new leader and it's very sad but I'm afraid we need to face up to facts. And that new leader, presumably, you would like to be someone who voted for Brexit, who has a completely different approach to Theresa May, or do you think actually you're still going to need a withdrawal agreement, or would you go for no deal? I don't want to be prescriptive, but I need a leader who has credibility and has authority. We need to reassert authority within the Conservative Party and rally round a new leader with a new approach, and then we need Parliament to rally round, and we need the country to rally round. Brexit has got to be resolved. It's not going to get resolved as we stand at the moment and clearly this this new approach which she outlined her speech yesterday and outlined again today is dead in the water it's not going to happen I'm afraid under the current ad administration and it's got to be changed uh, quickly it probably needs to be somebody who was absolutely committed to uh, to Brexit but let's see who's going to put their hats into the, the ring but whatever happens we need to get on with it Norton, thank you very much